Congratulations on your new Synology NAS purchase. This video will help get you started with your new device. We'll start with the NAS device and the hard disk out of their boxes. First, remove the front cover, if applicable, and the hard disk tray. Some models will have release tabs like the one shown here. Others will have trays that release by pressing the bottom of the tray's faceplate. To install the disk into the tray, you may have rails like this to install the disk without screws. If your model does not include this type of tray, use the screws included in the box to secure the drive. If using 2.5 inch disks, secure the drive using screws on the bottom of the tray, as shown here. Next, install your drive back into the device. Looking at the unit from the front, disks are enumerated 1 through 4 from left to right. If your disks are stacked vertically, disk enumeration starts with disk 1 at the top. Once your disks are secure in the unit, plug the cable into the power supply if applicable. Next, plug the cable attached to the power supply into the NAS. For four prong heads like this, note the divot placement in the female port and how that corresponds to the shape of the male connector. After the power connector is secure, install the network cable. Connect the other end of the network cable to your router, which is accessible from your computer or mobile device. For the final connection, plug the power supply into your outlet. Now you're ready to turn the device on. The blue power LED will flash until the device is ready. Once ready for software configuration, the device will beep and the status LED will turn orange to indicate a lack of operating system. To continue setting up your NAS, continue to the video titled DSM Installation. Thank you for watching.